folks. We are day two in Colorado. Um, just going to uh, go grab some breakfast and then I'm gonna go hit the lake. So stay tuned. Here comes the. Here comes the. Here comes the. Y'all don't really worry like that. Yeah. Here comes the. No. Here comes the. Alright, well we're having to make a stop here at the old Walmart. Wouldn't be a wouldn't be a vacation if you didn't have to stop at the old uh, Wally World here. So we're gonna go in, get our fishing license and uh, get some bait and we'll head out to the water. We'll see you out there. Alright ladies and gentlemen, we have made it out here. We are at a little place called Quail Lake. It sits right beneath the mountains here. Out in the background. It's probably the by far one of the prettiest places I've fished, so let's get our gear and we'll get set up and get ready to go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I got my grandpa set up with his trout stuff. I'm gonna throw a frog for a minute and see if there's any. See if there's anything in here that'll hit a frog. If not, I'm gonna switch over and. Uh, go to probably like a worm go after some catfish I think grandpa's already taking a nap over here Grandpa, are you awake? <laughs> Rigging up to put on a treble hook and an earthworm, see if I can't <clears throat> get either a little kitty cat or one of these sucker fishes. I don't know what they call them. If any of y'all are familiar with what they call their little sucker fish around here, uh, let me know. Leave me, leave me a comment. But not a hundred percent sure exactly what they call them. So when I get back from my trip, I'll uh, I think I'm gonna do a couple of videos, kind of showing you guys how I set up my rigs and um, depending on what I'm fishing for, um, I'm gonna show you guys how to make uh, homemade jugs. Um, and then I have a few other, I'm going to do a review of my bow that I use for bow fishing. Um, but keep in mind, I'm not sponsored by any of these companies. So this is just a simple review of what I use. It's not going to be a <clears throat> promotion of anything. It's just simply me showing you what I use and how I use it. Sit and wait. You know, we're fishing on the bottom today because the wind's a little high. But I'm gonna try to find. Homemade rod holder, Grandpa. Oh, yeah, I see. <laughs> Look at that view. What are the kind of like? I'm not sure there's some out there, but you know, I live in Oklahoma. There's there's no legs I can go to and see that kind of view. It's incredible. 
just absolutely beautiful. Ladies and gents, we've been out here, I don't know, maybe a little over an hour. Had a few nibbles. Grandpa's getting a nibble right now. Well, Grandpa, that lunch on Sunday is at a park with a pond, I think. I may get another one-day license and try again. All right, Grandpa, one more cast for me and then we'll go. I got one, Grandpa, I think. I can't tell, it's not really fighting. Yeah, I got one, Grandpa. There we go, a little trout, right at the end. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all for today. <laughs> Glad we got one right there at the end. That was fun. Was a good time hanging out with my grandpa. Beautiful scenery around here. them all around fun couple of hours well we're back here at the hotel um had a good day out on the water caught a little trout there at the end i got to hang out with my grandfather um, i don't get to see him very often so that was a lot of fun i mean that's what i love about fishing just you know it's it brings people together friends family whoever um, i've met a lot of cool people over the years and developed some friendships from fishing so I encourage y'all to get out there and get the rod and reel and go catch you some fish and make some friends. But uh, anyways, I'm gonna sign off here, um, get some food, get some sleep, and uh, I will see y'all on the next episode. If you like this video and you wanna see more like this, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. If you wanna leave a comment, maybe give me some ideas of what to do next. Um, maybe some challenges you want me to try. Um, I'll be heading back to Oklahoma here soon, so I'll be able to kind of do some more stuff like that. But if you guys want to see something, let me know. 